I tell people playing defensive back is the hardest thing that you'll do on the football field. You are playing a game at an elite level, at an elite speed. Here, get up, come on. If you don't communicate every single detail, of you end up giving up something that you shouldn't. I like the fly sweep, motion coming. Brady Owen, uh, Sergeant Luke. We have a 1034 in progress. Man, he be smiling all day. Yeah. Played college ball at UCLA. Coach Moore one day asked me what I was doing after I finished playing. You know, it's been special to go from being a player for him to trying to follow in his footsteps. Ah, uh, Coach Hill, that's my dog. Once he got the job here, everything changed. He makes me be better as a person, like on and off the field. I, I love Coach Hill because he, he gonna keep it real with you. He, he a real coach. He gonna tell you what you did wrong, what you did right. Read, tempo, speed, break. Yeah, Coach Hill can be kind of hard on you. Get your freaking helmet on and get over here. You, you have to be hard on DBs because like, you can't really have no soft DBs out there. On the sideline, you know, the big thing is communicating um, both in the play and after the play. Remember what we talked about when we're in the play, the guys that are not in the game are responsible for communicating the splits of wide receivers. You know, they're trying to communicate as much as they can to relay it to the guys that are on the field. The guys do a really good job of that and it, it gives them a sense of ownership because, you know, as coaches, we can only do so much. Communication is like the number one thing that we that we have to do so everything is on point because there's so much going on. So I just like talk to make sure everybody's on the same page so there won't be no holes in the defense. Man, Coach Hill, you just He's a genius, I'm not even gonna lie. He's like a DB mad scientist. Hey, give me weak palm six here. You know how some guys can just tell you how to do it, but coach can tell you how to do it, when to do it, and why. It's tricks, it's six this side. We don't wanna play a quarters tool over here. Does that make sense? Durante Jones, when he walks in a room, you know he's there. Durante gonna bring 150% every day, every snap. Durante is a confident young man who knows exactly what to do, when to do it, or where to be. Pick, pick. And that's what's exciting as a coach is when a guy doesn't want to just be told what to do, he wants to be able to coach it thereafter. So who got the tight end? He does. Oh, so, all right. Caleb's skill set is just versatile. When you get someone that's versatile, you like that because you're able to put him out there and understand that in any and every situation that the offense gives you, you're going to be okay. Oh, he got the perfect size for it. He got the perfect speed. He got the instincts. He, he's fast and he will tackle. Boom! Oh my God! Trey Worth, he's my cool, calm, collected, but very competitive senior. Nice job, Seven! He is the oldest one in my room, has the most experience. Honestly, done a great job of, of opening his mind to criticism as a positive thing. And I think it's only helped his game and helped him improve. Malcolm is one of our fastest defensive backs probably. Really, really good player, has a lot of length. He has a lot of upside, a lot of growth potential. And he's done a really good job this offseason of trying to learn the game of football at a high level, not only physically, but mentally. Alfred is one of my bigger safeties. He has a lot of versatility in terms of what he can do, but it's untapped because I don't know if he's realized how big he is yet. When he matches everything up and, and gains his confidence in both uh, realms, both run and pass, he's going to be an exciting player to watch. I love the game of football, but coaching is more exciting when you're doing it with really, really, really good people that want to win and want to represent the state. I'm excited to go out there and compete and show people what a Jim Mora team looks like. Oh man, I'm fired up. When we hit the field, it's gonna be a whole new, different team. No mercy. All the real supporters, just keep going with us. The ones who ain't really been with us, you'll see soon. <laughs>